Hi, it's John Chris Mace R&D. Today we have an SVX motor on our assembly bench. And we've got three of our pistons installed already. And we're going to have to install the others. This first three, I actually put the pistons on the rod and put the crank in the block and torque everything down, get that all set up. Then on the other side, I stick the pistons in the block. And now we have the center connecting rod at or near bottom dead center and what we're going to do is we're going to attempt to put the pin in here and then we're going to take and put our keeper in so we're going to show you how that's done my installation tool is about the same size as the piston pin just a slight bit smaller so I'm going to take the blunt end and stick it through so that I can actually get my connecting rod lined up. And get the piston so it's in the right orientation here. Anyway, I have the rod now positioned so it's gone through the piston bore, piston pin bore on one side, it's gone through the connecting rod, and it's gone into the other pin bore on the other side of the piston. Now you have to make sure that when you install this that you have the inboard, which would be this side over here, uh, clip in so that we can put it in, put the pin in from this side over here, and then we'll be able to put the other clip in and we'll be all done with this. I've made a special driver so that it just slips into the pin, like so, and then I'll be able to stick this in and install it in the piston and the connecting rod. All right, we've got the pin pushed all the way in and bottomed out. So now we're going to go ahead and withdraw our tool. And then we'll get set up to put the clip in. This is a special tool that I made for installing the center piston snap ring on the SVX motor. So just wanted to see what this kind of looks like. It's a pretty simple little device. A piece of aluminum with some dowels in there. All right, when you put this in, you want to make sure that you have the ends either facing towards the crankshaft or away from the crankshaft. And you can see that the clip is in right where it should be. If you have any questions about SVX Subaru Motors, give me a call here at Coast Mace R&D. We'll talk to you soon.